A door handle or a door knob is a handle used to open or close a door. Door handles can be found on all types of doors including exterior doors of residential and commercial buildings, internal doors, cupboard doors and vehicle doors. There are many designs of door handles depending on the appropriate use. A large number of handles, particularly for commercial and residential doors, incorporate latching or locking mechanisms or are manufactured to fit to standard door locking or latching mechanisms. Door knobs have a very interesting history. Although it's difficult to, pro to provide an exact date on when door knobs first came into use, the first documentation of the invention of a doorknob was in 1878. The US Patent Office received a submission made for improvements on a door closing device by an African American inventor named Osborne Dorsey. Doorknobs and door handles are now a vital part of modern doors and drawers. Before door knobs and door handles were invented, people often just used locks with keys if they could afford to have a lock fitted. Alternatively, instead of locking a door, they would simply keep their valuables in boxes or chests that could be locked and the key kept safe. For the wealthy, a servant called Chamberlain would be trusted with the keys to the king's locks, who would keep his treasures locked away in a bedroom. Therefore, closing doors and keeping them secure didn't actually require door knobs. The problem was that locks were very expensive and poorer people just didn't have the money to be able to afford them. That meant that they had to be relying on simpler, cheaper ways to open and open, to open and close doors. For this, they came up with the latching string. By using this method, which involved the use of a bar across the door, people inside were kept safe and so were their possessions. So instead of a door handle or knob, they would make a small hole in the door and insert a laser tongue or piece of string or cord and loop it around the bar, pulling the cord enabled the bar to be raised, which meant that someone could enter. This latch string method wasn't really practical for interior doors of large houses. However, as it took too long to undo and redo the latches as you walked through the house. Today, door and drawer handles are made from different materials and one of these materials is rebar. Rebar, short for reinforcing bar, is a steel bar or mesh of steel wires used as a tension device in reinforced concrete and reinforced masonry structures to strengthen and aid the concrete under tension. Rebar significantly increases the tensile strength of the structure. Rebar surface is often deformed with ribs, lugs, or indentations to promote a better bond with concrete and reduce the risk of slippage. Hello, hello, dear viewers. Welcome back to our channel. Today we have brought to you rebar door and drawer handle knob or knob ideas. This video contains a collection of simple handles and knobs you can make from rebar. You can pick your favorite design and try to make it at home or show it to local workshops so that they can make one for you. You can even turn these plans or designs into a lucrative small-scale manufacturing business with a small initial investment on basic tools and materials. So we advise you to watch the video until the end to never miss a thing and choose an inspiring design for your next project. If you are new to the channel and if you like what you see, please consider subscribing to the channel and smash the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified when I upload new videos. If you are already a subscribed member, please like and share this video so that it could reach a wide range of audience.
Handles are not a piece to be placed only on doors. Including interior and exterior doors, handles are also placed on cabinets, cupboards, alley mirrors, and so on. They come up in different sizes, colors, designs, and finish. From ceramic to brass to glass, the list of handles is endless. They transform the house into beautiful decor complementing your kitchen, bathrooms, or living rooms. From classic vintage styles to modern contemporary designs, handles can be found in beautifully crafted designs. Thankfully, door handles and door knobs are now widespread both on interior and exterior doors. External door handles may be accompanied by a lock for safety and security, and interior door handles and door knobs may be left without for easy access throughout a building. The most common types of door handle are the lever hand lock and door knob. Door handles can be made out of a variety of materials. Examples include brass, porcelain, cut glass, wood, and bronze. Door handles have been in existence for at least 5000 years and its design has evolved since, with more advanced mechanism, types, and designs made. Some door handles are arm or foot operated to reduce transmission of contagious illnesses. Pull door handles or simply pull handles are U-shaped and are used especially in the kitchen but also for drawers. Usually these are made of metal. We have all become suddenly more aware of the moments when we cannot avoid touching elements of public buildings. Architecture is most physical, most imposing and most present of the arts you cannot avoid yet. Strangely, we touch buildings at only a few points, the handrail, perhaps a light switch, and almost unavoidably the door handle. This modest piece of handle-held handle architecture is our critical interface with the structure and the material of the building, yet it is often reduced to the most generic, cheaply made piece of bent metal which is, in its way, a potent critique of the value of place on architecture and our acceptance of its reduction to a, commod a commodified envelope rather than an expression of culture and craft. Despite their ubiquity and pivotal role in the haptic experience of architecture, door handles remain oddly underdocumented. There are no serious stories and only patchy surveys of design, mostly sponsored by manufacturers. For as long as there have been doors, there have been door handles. They may have been primitive to start, an iron or wood latch, a turned wooden knob, a piece of string or a leather strap. The common door handles that are found on the market include the following. Number 1. Ceramic Handles In the long listing of door handles, ceramic handles are the most common type of handles that are generally used. Ceramic is non-metallic material that provides high strength, hardness, and anti-static features to the handles. Number 2. Glass Handles These are most popular in contemporary designs. Glass handles, these are the elegant handles that add a vintage, shiny and classy look to the handles. Number 3. Wooden handles. These types of handles are another variety of handles that are widely used. The reason behind their wide use is they come up at affordable prices, 
with a subtle and classy, classy look. Manufacturers make them in different styles and colors to give them aesthetic touch and feel. Number 4. Metal Handles When we talk about quality and durability, metal handles rank first on the list. These handles are long-lasting because they have antibacterial properties and are rust-free. Among the metallic handles, those made with Riva are the focus point of our today's video. Well, dear viewers, as you can see in the video, we have compiled a number of interesting rebar door knobs and door handles. Which one is your favorite and why? Let us know in the comment section. By now, you know that our channel is full of inspiring videos which you can use in your projects from time to time. If you like our content, please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already. And also smash the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified when you upload new videos. Thank you for watching until the end. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Until then, stay safe and stay blessed.